Welcome back to My Crazy Landlord. So, if you haven't seen the other episodes in this series of Crazy Town Banana Pants Landlord, click right there to start on episode one. If you the saw, the last, you saw the last episode, yeah. The text message that came in and the text message that got sent back. They did not show up, so there is that. So they did not show up. And we kind of find out why they didn't show up shortly thereafter when my sister-in-law. She's calling and calling and calling and I didn't know she was calling, but I finally got to the phone. <laughs> she apparently got a call from the landlord. Mm-hmm. Now, the connection there is they used to be together. Mm -hmm. They have a, a, a son. They have a child together, so they stay in contact with each other. So that's how they know each other. So he calls her up. Tell them what happens next. Apparently, he was screaming and cussing her. He was so pissed off at her for um, her family moving in here and causing him all these problems. And like he Us was, causing the problem. Right. He was yelling at her, you know, like crazy because it's the kind of person he is. So, you know, blaming her for the whole thing. And then and she's like, well, what did they do wrong? What did they do that's made you so angry? And she said that all he could say was like, well, I didn't almost run over their son. And he said I did. And she's like, and what else? And that was it. That was all he could say that we've done wrong as tenants. Because we haven't done anything. We've always paid rent on time. Mm -hmm. Rent's paid. Never had an issue. Uh, not from our end. Yeah. Uh, but as you've seen throughout these videos, it's been nonstop with this crazy landlord. So she, me and her are talking on the phone, and he, she says, well, he's really mad, and he says that in two weeks, y'all are going to have court. And he said he's put $5,000 into an attorney, and that he's going to spend all 50000 that he has in his bank account if he has to. Just, Just to make us pay. Like, what? Like, what did we do? What did we do? <laughs> <laughs> he's going to make us pay. Every problem that has been had has been a direct result of his actions. And you know, it would make sense if there was something we had done, maybe. It would make a little bit of sense. I don't know. I feel like this is harassment. And then threatening, like, basically he told her to tell us this. Yeah. That he is taking us to court, that he'll spend $50,000 taking us down. Like, he told her to tell us that, trying to scare us out of this place, I suppose. Right? I mean, that's, is that not crazy? Who does that? <sighs> to me, yeah, I don't know. That seems a little bit like communicating a threat. Mm -hmm. um, but I guess that's a matter for someone else to handle, not me. <laughs> um, I just, like, the, just the audacity that people could actually be living in these types of situations all throughout America is very disheartening. And I feel like there should be a change somewhere about how, you know, tenants should have definite rights. I know they say that tenants have rights. Tenants have rights, but there was a time where we had to call the police. And it was that night with the truck. Um, and they couldn't do anything. So as long as he's not in the house, they can't do anything. And it's like, well, so what rights do we have? The only rights we would have is to drop a bunch of money on an attorney and take him to court. That's it. How is that our rights? So if you're poor, you have no rights. Basically, it's the way the system is set up. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, but we're not gonna let him win that no. easily. And, and all he would have to do, this is the crazy thing. I don't give him the secret, because what if he sees this video and he's like, oh, well, I should have just done that. All he would have to do is that, and I'm not even gonna say what it is, because what if he's watching? I hope you are watching. You're a terrible, terrible human being. <laughs> <laughs> What's she saying? <laughs> Y'all make sure that you put it in the comments if you think that this is normal behavior from a landlord. There's no way. You don't think so? No. Do any of y'all think it's okay? It's not. It's crazy. But wait. There's, There's more. more. See you on the next one.